still haven't just went out to no club yet or anything only thing i have been doing is like going to stores or going to the restaurant damn fine i'm proud of myself yeah uh huh I'm sweating like I'm hot. One more phone stop. Hey. Good day, Mama. She did take the step out. Get some in now. That's so edge out. To some ice, but you'll be heavy in my mind. Can you get the heck out? I mean, grass now, got me bummed out. You so, you so, you, baby. Hey, y'all, welcome back to another vlog. It's the weekend vlog. Just finished feeding my face. I had some water burger. A kid's meal, but they gave me this big old drink. That's the crazy part. A kid's meal with a big drink. So I got a snack. But anywho, if you are new to my channel, welcome baby, they know me as Drea. You wanna come a Drea baby, just hit that subscribe button. That's all you have to do, join the Drea baby gang, okay? Cause what? We be lit over here. <laughs> but um, I took my press arms off cause I need to put some more back on. Follow them, I went and got my toes done. And I didn't need my eyebrows done cause I had just got them done last week. So I didn't need to get my eyebrows done. I just pulled up to uh, Ulta Beauty because I need some more foundation. And I need uh, one of my shade of color of my concealer and hope I can find a nice banana uh, powder setting for me. I don't want a real light one, but I want something that's gonna blend just right for me. Y'all know I don't do a lot with my makeup, but I do a little something, if that makes sense, but yeah. so. How this weekend vlog is going to go, I don't know because I'm really off this weekend, but I have to work tomorrow. It's OT. You turn on tripping. Whoop, whoop. It's OT because I have to work for my coworker again. And I get off early though, so I'm not tripping. I get off early, so I don't know what this weekend consists of. Um, I know my uncle, who I told y'all about, parties tomorrow, so still indecisive of going there because I still haven't just went out to no club yet or anything. Only thing I have been doing is like going to stores or going to the restaurants like that but club club? Yeah, I don't know just yet but even if I do go I could just really chill. I don't have to drink. Well, actually I take that. I don't have to drink like how I usually drink because I know today me and baby is going to go get us something to eat and i can finally have me a good drink y'all my doctor said yeah so i haven't had a good drink in a minute y'all <laughs> i haven't had one in a minute it's been bothering me okay because sometimes we'll be going you know like how we did the last time i wanted to kill a little margarita or something i couldn't even get it but no yeah so remember i go to the doctor on tuesday so hopefully by then I will be able to take these pads off and just have the bra on or start gradually getting other bras but yeah i'm just giving y'all update opening up the vlog i had just finished eating like i told y'all about to run up into ulta because i have to get some little things and i will catch y'all inside oh what a relief it is it's been a minute since i've been in here because I haven't worried about getting no makeup right now. Now, y'all, I'm only coming here for what I told y'all. That's what I'm going to do. If y'all did not know, I love Morphe um, stuff. Oh, he has the setting spray. Should I try out his foundation this time? I never used his. I always use NYX. I think I want to try his. I think I want to try his foundation out. Yeah.
My skin reflection has kind of changed. Can you put in your other times usually? Are you more warm or more cool? I'm more warm. That's what I was thinking too. Yeah, I'm more warm. Because even once I start putting my concealer on as well, it gives it a nice tone color. One up. Okay. So the 30. The 30. That one's gonna have neutral undertones. Okay. This one, the difference is it's not necessarily just like a lot of darker, it's the undertones will change on them. Okay. This has got golden red undertones. Um that one will have neutral undertones. Um, they have one. Let's try. Oh, and they like they have a last box of uh -huh. that one. Um this is deep rich with golden red. This is darker. This is the one that's darker than this one. Okay. Okay, neutral. Red red neutral. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. and I don't have one to try for that one either. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can make one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah I was like, this time I want to try yeah. Morphe. I love Morphe actually because I have the lipstick and everything from him, but I was like, let me try the foundation this time, because I'm always yeah. going NYX, I always. I think they were shutting, shutting down. Really? Yeah, but. Do you have anything on your face now? No. Trying to see which color is best for me, y'all. <laughs> they were, until we ran out, Every show about, I uh -huh. didn't see my phone. Really? I was, yes. I was like, oh my god. See, I've been wearing glasses no. since I was little. Yeah? Yes. I am. Um, and I was thinking about doing the LASIK. Really? Mm -hmm. My dad did that and he, he loves it except he still has for reading glasses. Okay. I hear some folks say they do still some, mm -hmm. but they some don't down. have to do have nothing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I think I tried this one on you. Or I? I think you tried this, this is 20 one. That's I grabbed one. another one. Oh, okay, 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 um, okay. The one I opened was this one. So this, this, the one is, right the, here. this is the this is the D33. This is the one I should have box. So this one has different undertones. I okay. That's why I grabbed it. It's got, um, it doesn't have any red undertones. It okay. It's deep, rich with neutral undertones. Okay. So I grabbed that one too. But we're going to try. Put them on your face. Have you ever tried the black opal? No, I haven't. Yeah, I'll tell you. That stuff, and I've never even heard of it before. And right, so, I have went to Ulta, got me some stuff. I didn't go overboard, you know, but next time I'm going there, I just get a whole bunch of like facial stuff on my face, start getting my face together and everything. As y'all can see, I kind of broke out up under my chin, and I need to get some stuff, and then, um, Basically, just get it. Basically, get it under control, y'all. And we're now in Burlington. About to see what they have going on in here. See what they got new. They putting all their little stuff out because you know it's the holiday. So when they start putting all that out, then you know it's time. So I'm about to look and see what they have in here. And yeah. All right, back at the house, y'all. I see how to clean my camera real. I, I had to do a deep clean on this camera because when I was editing, my stuff was looking real, real blur looking, dust looking, like I ain't clean my lens and stuff. So I'm sorry for that, but yeah, I had to do a clean. But anywho, back at the house, got my stuff in Ulta. I did get some things from Burlington. So let's open up and see what all I have. So I have the Morphe uh, setting spray. Uh, I never tried his setting 
spray so this will be my first time trying it i'll give y'all the full review on it and then i have my foundation and i gotta do morphe as well because you know usually i always do nyx and then i have my concealer that i like to use and i do my eyebrows sometimes so i don't i always use the la girl for some of the things that i like to do when it comes to concealing and then I have my makeup wipes I like to use from um, Neutrogena, Neutrogene. So I have that, all the goody things that I needed. And then I was gonna get the Morphe setting powder, the banana powder, but I was like, mm, let me try a little off brand one for right now just to see because I really don't use banana powder like that. But I was like, I want to start stepping up my makeup and doing little different things with it and stuff, playing around. So I got this out of Burlington. It was $3.99. And this is by Beauty Treats. So it's the Set and Go banana one. Banana powder. And it looks cool. It's uh it gives a natural glow finish, it says. And then I end up getting this um facial scrub so it has it's a vitamin c through envy and this is how it look it was 3.99 and then i end up getting the neutrogena uh neutrogena hydro boost cleaning gel this was 2.99 i just got the little small one just to see how i like it so when i clean my face after taking my makeup off because when i take my makeup off from wiping with the the makeup wipes i like to do a clean so i did say i want to start getting into um really deep cleaning my face like how i used to get my steamer out like literally open up my pores get in deep into my skin cleaning like i need to and start you know give me black marks because i literally broke out as you can tell up under my chin real bad and then from me picking at the jam bumps busting them yeah so i gotta get the skin under control y'all i really do um one minute i get it there and then they say you know i about stop and get it back off and it's like come on drea come on drea get it together now but i did say i want to go back to ulta beauty and just stack up on all my cleaning products for my face like just get everything that i need out of there it's just the fact that i need to start getting my stuff stacking it up getting you know just basically keeping my face together like it's part of your hygiene so keeping my face together and you know just doing what i'm supposed to do so yeah those are all the things that i did get today i've been rocking my hair like this this head over my head because i did wash my blonde wig i'm going back to the blonde one i just feel like that's that's me and with it being fall and how it's looking it's just the color for it right now i just feel like that's me so i had washed it real good i bone flat iron it straight and put a little curl at the end so it's the curls are not all over this time it's more straight than anything and i pushed the baby hairs back so i'll see if i want to add the baby hairs back because you know it had the baby hairs then so i'll see if i want to add add them back or not i'll see once i install the wig back on my head but yeah i need to pop these nails back on my fingers i need to file them real good clip uh clip them get the cuticle stuff all cleaned up because they looking a hot funky mess and just chill and relax until i figure out where we're going and to figure out what i'm going to put on because y'all know how i'm still rocking with the whole bra situation in these pads so any type of top i wear of course it has to be closed until you know i'm able to just do my fully fully pop out so like i said hopefully when i go tuesday um we should know from there see from there what's what and because i'm really kind of over the bed i could deal with the bra but i'm kind of over the pads but i understand why i have to have them there but i'm kind of over them the scar up under the breast is itching really really bad so i'm going to ask my doctor 
what can I throw I put on that on that scar and also will he provide me the silicone strip so I won't uh keloid as well because you know when you get the messing with and scratching it will start to a keloid so I didn't figure out what he would give me to do because that this scar up on the up under is itchy itchy when I say itchy itchy y'all itchy itchy so <sighs> oh yeah I cooked gumbo yesterday no, day before yesterday, I had cooked gumbo. We had it yesterday for leftover. It was real good, y'all. I never cooked gumbo. That was my first time cooking it, and I did damn good. I was I shocked my own self. Because I was like, well, I'm going to try it and see, because I want to get out that element of cooking other things that I know I never cooked before. So I was like, let me try it out and see. And I did it. At first, because I, I was in, in my head like, oh, if it ain't good, I'm just going to eat it because it's already cooked. I didn't already put my stuff in. It is what it is. I just know next time what I have to put in there, what I need to add. Like, I do my research. Like, what I need to learn. Like, not learn, but what else I need to put in there. And I did good for the first time. Literally. My root, everything was good. So, I asked baby because I'm like, oh, it smells just like come on now. And then when baby ate it. He said, I'll be damn, baby. He said, I just knew you was the fuck up. He said it just like that. My, I'm saying, y'all, that man has no filter. He has no filter. He said that in my face. I was like, I just knew you took the fuck up, baby. Because he said, I, he said, I was like, well, at least she tried. She'll try again next time. But he like, the fact that you got it right the first time, he said, oh, yeah, you a motherfucker then. Oh, yeah. He said, well, I know we got for uh, when it get cold. I say, hmm. Because, you know, I make my chili when it get cold. But... Now I can add gumbo on to that. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> good, man. Yeah, it was real good, y'all. We had our crackers. Oh, yeah, it was real good, y'all. Girl, did the damn thing. I'm proud of myself. Yeah. Uh-huh. I had to go in the office yesterday for a little bit because my computer had started messing up on me. So, the IT tech, he had to do some little, you know, to it. And then, um, came back home. He called me today and sent me some of the parts that he had to buy. It's in. So, I got to go up there Monday when I clock back in. Because he's not going to be here this weekend. Because you know, I got to work tomorrow and stuff for a little bit. So, he's off. So, I go up there Monday. Either before I clock in or while I'm clocked in. And, you know do that but oh uh, what else happened that's pretty that's pretty 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 much that's been going on y'all that i've been keeping y'all updated on i got to return that phone back now that i didn't cleared it out put everything into my new one and so far i'm liking it i have no complaints about it the camera is really 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 good um i was recording some of the stuff like today with the phone so yeah i i like it i have no complaints about it i thought i phone did their damn thing with it i can say they, they did their damn thing uh today is my little cousin birthday i don't know what he has planned so far he said nothing so far he said nothing so yeah today his birthday and what else yeah oh i did say i want to ask i need to ask my doctor when can i start wearing my waist trainer back because y'all see i'm so blown i'm starting to get that's from just sitting here eating too and healing but it's gonna all snap back once it get 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 that together it's gonna all snap back and just you know how you just be like okay i'm ready to get back to the what I used to do a little bit, but it's all a process, all a process, and um, that's pretty much it, y'all. I'm just giving y'all an update, letting y'all know I'm at the house, what I'm about to get ready to do. Like I said, I'm fit to do these nails. I do want to clean my face to, right now, just so it can be fresh and clean, just because, you know, she had did, uh, she had to make sure that the color that I had picked was a set and good color, so I want to do me a deep clean, I want to do me a clean face. And then when I put my makeup on, it's going to just lay just right on me tonight. So, I don't know if we're going to do like an evening, night. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. So, you know, <laughs> I will talk to y'all later. Bye. Okay. I to get myself together, y'all. I ate me uh, some of my gumbo that I had left. And 
took me a good me nap, y'all. A nap that I really needed. Then woke up to them talking about the whole thing for Tupac and stuff. How the guy got, how they finally got him, and he just running out at the mouth with detectives and everything. Like, what y'all think about that whole situation? Like, that's just crazy. Do y'all think the uh, Diddy paying that man to go do that and then follow through with the money? So that's why they end up coming after Biggie too. I don't know. This is a whole bunch of mess. I hate how the whole thing happened. Cause it's crazy how both of them passed away in the car. Like, same way. That shit is weird. But it did the whole thing about Jada picking y'all. Like, girl, just shut up. Sometimes it's just, it just needs to be quiet. Talking about how you and Will wasn't uh, together since, uh, what, 2016, 2017 and stuff. Girl. Why stay like I don't understand it? Y'all should just got divorced. Oh, I'm sorry, people marriages, but that right there is just weird as shit. And then how she was talking about her and Tupac, how he proposed to her when he was in jail, and yeah, yeah. Anywho, about to put my wig. Yeah, I had got this from the beer supply, and it has six caps in here. I think this is the best thing they ever did. The best, and you come out way cheaper. Way cheaper than buying one that has two in there or just one and you still paying them the same price. So good that they came with it. So good. And um I ordered my contacts, so hopefully they'll be here next week. If not, I'm gonna trip it. At least I know I ordered them and I know they on the way, so Push that back a little bit. And yeah, I got my wig cap on now. And I still put my wig uh, cap on here. Not cap, but what you want to call it? Wig, the elastic uh, gripper. I still use that. And I charged up my light so when I do my close-ups, I can kind of see what I'm doing. It's currently 7.14. I don't know where we're going to eat at. I did send baby some stuff that I had seen on Instagram that I had saved. So he going through it. Yeah, we get to try our new foundation. So I'm excited about that to see how this is going to turn out for you, girl. Hopefully, I like it. But I liked it when she was... Um, putting it on me or whatever but it wasn't just my color so this color she did not have for a tester so we like okay we just took a while i guess and say okay this will be the closest so we have to find out and see but they told me if i don't like it i could always bring it back in exchange for you know oh you can do that so we can try it out and see give it a try i can't wait i can't wait it's something about when you buy new makeup girl it's just something about it like it's fresh, it's new, smell new. Yeah. <laughs> what else I got? I have to open this up. And I'm about to go ahead and start getting my stuff together. Um, I already got my outfit, what I'm wearing out. Of course, y'all already know I still gotta stay covered up. Forwards at the top. So I'm wearing my top that I did wear. I only wore it one time and it was for my meeting group. I'm wearing that top with some leather kind of shorts that I did get from Shein and my heels. And I'm wearing my black purse that I had got from Timo. I'm gonna wear that. And yeah. Simple and nice and cute. I need to wash these makeup brushes after these. I had cleaned my face real good, as you could tell, like it's looking clean, but it's all a process. It's all a process, all a process. Yeah, I know I'm not the whole skincare girly, you know, doing the skincare routine stuff, but I definitely, like I said, I got to get on my shit with keeping my face clean, keeping, it out my, keeping my hands out my face a lot, and... All the above, you know, just doing what I'm supposed to do. But it be so hard sometimes when you constantly just in your face. Do 
I think I got some more of this with me. You know, this is empty. I need to go through this damn uh, makeup bag and see what's all in here because I can just only imagine half of the shit that's in here. And if I was to go through all this stuff, I bet I got probably some of the same shit that I don't need. I bet I do. That's bronzer. Look at that. The gold bronzer. And I love this. It's the Burberry uh brand. It's the gold glow. I love it. Only when I'm doing that look. So I don't use it as much. I didn't really show y'all using it. So I don't use it as much. But I love it though. Love it, love it, love it. Highly recommend. Um, Actually, I had got this one. I didn't go inside the Burberry store and get this one. But I went and got this one out of... Uh, at the time, it was Macy's. Got it out of Macy's. I remember last time. When I had been inside the Burberry store, it's been years from when I had got my tennis shoes. That was years when I had got the Burberry tennis shoes. Of course, they gone because after a while, they get old looking and stuff. The ones I had, they was looking like the Converse kind. So... All right, y'all, let me not get the store yet because I know me and then get the store pressing for time. Y'all already know how restaurants roll down here unless we find a spot like we did the last time. They stay open pretty much late, something like that. But most of all these other spots, you know, they be closing around fucking 10 o'clock. And I don't want to be pussing at me, so this going to be a little quick montage. Not, not my child, but a quick little V roll. And yeah, let's go ahead and do my makeup now. That's why I can't wait really until I get my contacts. I ain't got to worry about doing this and having this in my face because when I have my contacts, I can see. You know, you know I'm blind. Man, who, yeah, <laughs> back to music. <laughs> Take a step out, get some in now, let so edge out, to some ice book, you'll be heavy in my mind. Can you get the heck out? I mean grass now, drop me bundle. So I'm looking at Poe through the mirror. But one thing about my girl, she gonna get her hookah. Okay? You tell her it's hookah on deck, she gonna come get her hookah wherever she at. She gonna come get that hookah. Then yesterday I was watching uh, D uh, Live. Y'all, when I tell you I was rolling when she had went up in Razoo's about that gumbo. I was in tears laughing. Oh my gosh. I was so freaking in tears laughing. That shit was so funny. It was unreal. <laughs> that shit was funny as hell. Cause baby, she was like this for five dollars. Baby, when, one thing about when them, them restaurants have them little sales going on and stuff, they don't give you a lot of food because they want you to get the big meal then. They want you to get the big bowl. That shit was so funny though because she was so serious. She was like, can y'all give me some more? That shit was funny as hell. Okay, y'all. Let me back doing my makeup. <laughs> my little parts but I didn't I don't know if I did if I didn't I didn't I'm just gonna repeat myself if I didn't I had used my setting spray 
on my brush and I use some of my foundation and I have no complaints so far. I'm loving the um, results of how it's feeling on me. Now I'm about to take my banana and see how this gonna work out for you girl. Y'all know I don't really do all this but I'm gonna try it out, see if it works for me. But so far I have, like I say, no complaints on what I'm using. I never really had no complaints anyways when it came down to using um, his products because I have used Morphe products before. I have his lipstick and like his uh, uh, pencils and everything. Yeah, I have his pencils and everything so I was like... I really don't have no complaints about his stuff. But I didn't know that they had shut down some of his locations. And I'm like, why did not know that? And Because the lady was telling me. And she was like, yeah, they had shut down some. Because I remember I used to go to um, the Galleria and get some of his stuff. So, yeah, she said they had closed some of, some of his locations down. And they still just selling them in the stores, so which is still cool. Yeah, no, I do not do setting powder like this. And I, that means I need to buy more love sponges because I don't like that. That was just on there. So I hope I like the outcome. I hope I like the outcome, y'all, for me using this. Then they say you got a little shit of a little bit. So we go see. We go see, y'all. I like, you know doing this tonight but if not I'm gonna stick to what I know how I do my makeup I had a little blush but I said no it's doing too much I'm not that blush girl so yeah but anyway yeah I don't really have no complaints on the, what I'm using and everything feels good so far Cause you could tell the difference when you use certain makeup. If you do makeup, you know the difference. But I ain't got no that I can really say. I don't have no complaints. But got my lashes and yeah, this makeup did pretty good for me. This foundation, so I'm gonna keep using it, see how I feel. Cause the test really comes tonight when uh. You know, we out in the back. That's when you'll know, like, if it's worth using and everything. And I'm going to put a little of my glow on here tonight. I just feel like just getting really, really cute. Like, going up doing a whole full night on my face. I did. And I just, like I said, I'm just trying to get the hang of doing my makeup a little different. I'm always doing the same little traditional thing. I just been wanting that, that look. So, I do need to buy some more brushes. Definitely gotta go on Amazon, buy some more brushes. About that time, get some more of my sponges, get, get the new ones that's up to date. And yeah, let this kind of sit a little bit. And then I'm gonna put my lashes on, pop my wig on, and then I will catch y'all once I'm done, show y'all the finished look. So, bye. Gotta hold my own, my cross to bed alone. I'm too to deal 
Sweating up under my neck. That's why I'm a fat at. Jesus. Come on. I always want earring when I give you hell. shoes on so I gotta put my ring on and a little bracelet I might wear my charm bracelet tonight since I don't have a lot of silver jewelry like that so that's probably the look but I'm like how I did this hair mm -hmm. this is real cute this is how the makeup turned out on you girl yeah I like it I I, I can't see myself doing my makeup like this all the time mm-hmm okay yeah, let me finish getting myself together and y'all get the full, full finish look. All right, y'all. Dress. I'm hot. Oh, I can't wait to get some of this weight off me, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Can't wait. But anywho, this is how the outfit is looking. This top from Akira. My shorts from uh, Shein. And then my shoes, of course, from Akira with my Timu purse. And this is how... The whole outfit is rocking. Very cute. Cute, cute, cute. It's like it's giving, but it's still calm, but giving. You know what I'm saying? So, about to get ready and head out. We are going to Forgive Me Not. Hopefully, it is not packed and we can get in with seating because I did not do no or no reservations or anything so hopefully we'll be able to get in just two of us it should be good so we shall see this is our first time going now and i will catch y'all when i get there i need to cool down because like i'm sweating up under my neck i'm sweating like i'm hot so yeah something in your eyes babe telling me to our destination oh i'm sure y'all hear the music in the back so it's gonna be a lot of music going on having our day nights hubby looking handsome so yeah some music going on so of course i will show y'all the inside this is how the outside look you guys
Some. But take this wig off. This is how the makeup has ended for me tonight. It did good. The little pieces were a little bit oily. I do need to eventually invest in something for my face for the oil. Um, so I need to see exactly what to invest in. It's this other. It's this. I forgot what the what his name. What it's called. I'm gonna put the picture up. This is what they use. I'm gonna put the picture up. This is what they use. Couldn't think. I can't think of it right now. Anywho, the place was real, real cool. Give it a 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. Um, hookah was. Didn't I say $40? Yeah. $40? <laughs> so, 
yeah, it was forty dollars for hookah, so we didn't get hookah though. And I was able to drink. Uh, I was able to drink, so I had two uh, lemon drops that were seven dollars. They had like a little seven seven dollar martini martini thing going on because of football and stuff. Um, I had got the fried crab. I mean fried lobster and. It had crab fried rice. I had substituted for that because it came with asparagus already and uh, crawfish mac and cheese. I don't, y'all know I don't eat mac and cheese, so I had substituted for that. Baby had fried chicken with that was su it was called Southern Fried Chicken with macaroni, and he had some greens. And he said it was real good food. Like it was real good, y'all. It gets you full. You ain't got to worry about nothing. Like literally, it gets you full. It is worth the money. Oh, uh, the drinks was real good. The vibe in there was just awesome. Like the DJ was DJing in there. Like since the time we walked in there, sat down, he was on it. Like literally on one. No, no, like hiccups on. Damn, why you playing this? Like on one with the DJ. Okay, but as far as that, um. The, like I said, the place was real nice. I love how the decor now and everything, aesthetic looking in there. Real picture, 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 like perfect for people who want to take their pictures. The restroom was real nice for the ladies so if they want to take pictures in there. I did take some. Yeah, the place was real cool. I like it. The place was real cool. So they did say after a certain time, of, the, of, of course, it turns to like a little club, which is understandable. Um... But it's not like you gotta leave. It's just they telling you like it turns to a little club. What you do because the DJ is there. People start buying sections and uh, the food is still going. I don't know what time like the kitchen will close. Like once it turns to something like that, I don't know. But it's all crowded and because I don't like. I don't know if it's because I got older or something, but I don't like a lot of crowd places like that no more. Like, my anxiety started fucking with me real hard when I'm in, like, super, super crowded spots. So, I like a real chill, laid back. Um, I like a hype vibe, but when it's overcrowded, too crowded for me, I don't like all that. So, I get to move around or I just want to leave because I just... I don't, it's it just, like I said, my eyes are messing. Too much stuff happens when it get too, too crowded like this. So, I don't like to be around a lot of stuff. And I want to have fun when I'm out compared to when it's so overcrowded. You can't even really enjoy yourself like you want to because it's too damn crowded. So, especially for my birthday, I'm like, I want a crowd, but not like to where it's just ridiculous. But I definitely want to have my plans together by this week just so I can give um whatever I gotta give for us deposit and then on top of that get arrangements set for my birthday around Thanksgiving. I wanna make sure people are able to attend when I send it out, you know, like just give my invitations out at an early convenience of time for people. Yeah. yeah. I don't know for some reason like when it's time to plan stuff for myself, my birthday, I be so like draggy and indecisive on things because i'm like i don't know what i want to do i don't know what i'm gonna do because i'm so used to going on a cruise around my birthday so when i have to have a party for myself it's like it is what it is i don't care what we have it at y'all y'all just go come here we're gonna have fun <laughs> so i say this time i'm gonna be organized and get it together like Literally, I'm not getting drunk like I did the year before. I'm definitely not doing that again. Hell no. Nah. Like, it was over in 10.5 seconds. <laughs> not doing that again. So, I'm definitely uh, going to make sure I drink responsible. Going to drink responsible. So, I'm about to clean my face. Like, literally, my makeup came out so gorgeous. I love how I did my hair this time. I had pushed the baby hairs back. I just really like how I did it this time. I didn't do too much. It just, this just fits me. This fits me. So cute. So, so cute. But yeah, clean our face. Take a shower. Take a shower. Wanna get in the shower with me, baby? Yeah. Boy, you full of shit. <laughs> I just wanted to see what he was gonna say, y'all.
<laughs> Conveniently, right now with both. But <laughs> I'm about to do that and then lay up under the hubby. I'm not gonna get up in the morning and clog in and get this money. So I will talk to y'all tomorrow, either on break or when I get out, because I don't know, like I say, we're still kind of in the iffy of my uncle stuff tomorrow or not, but you know, I'm gonna keep y'all up to date on everything. Regardless, I get out for early, so even if we just wanna ride around, chill. We'll do that. Or if not, just chill at home. Watch us some movies and stuff. Eating some good old popcorn. Do me a deep clean again. And lay it down, y'all. So, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good night. We used to be best friends. Have to change. Drew here, let me say it. Whoa, whoa. Up your heart. And I know you've been waiting to. Hey y'all. Happy Saturday. Yeah, it's Saturday. Hold on. It's Saturday. Oh, y'all see, I had put my wig back on, did my makeup. I just feel like being. <laughs> Ever like being pretty and then I'm going to do a little sit down record uh, about my phone and stuff. Because I was like, why not? Why not get it to y'all? But I just like at the same time, I just feel like getting cute. Because I'm, I've been told y'all this plenty and plenty of times. I'm tired of looking how I basically feel. I'm tired of looking like, I'm tired of looking how I feel. I'm over it. Like, I'm ready for the bounce back. I'm ready for the bounce back. Like baby say, I shouldn't be looking like how I always feel. Which is true, but sometimes them days be hard. When your girl be kind of a little struggling a little bit. And be going through the motions in the, in the ocean, okay? But, I'm going to do that. Of course, y'all know I am working. This is my OT. It is so beautiful outside, y'all. When I tell you, gorgeous, like... Uh, this will be the day I pick my OT, huh? This will be the day I pick it. And it is so... It is so beautiful out there. The wind blowing. It's just... It's so relaxing. But I do have my... um My door open. So I got that good breeze coming in as I'm working. I'm glad it's not as busy. So... Thank God. <laughs> Which it usually don't be on the weekend. It don't be like stupid dumb like doing a weekday. On the weekends, it's pretty calm, laid back. Like, yeah. It's really the weekend when they get the acting. I mean, the weekday when they act really stupid. But weekends be pretty, pretty cool. So, I'm about to just, of course, change my top. I might do my little bottoms. I'm, I'm, it depends on how I record. It depends where I record it. Because it's just going to be a little quick uh, video I'm talking about my phone. You know, giving it a real review on it and the settings that I had put on there for it. But what else is going on? That's pretty much it. Oh, we're not going to my uncle party. Because remember I told y'all I didn't know if we was going to go or not. Like I was in, we was indecisive of it. So we're not going. We're going to stay in and just chill, relax, lay up on each other. Eat us some popcorn most likely. Watch us some movie. Have us our movie night which like baby said me too dog i told him i was like it's cool going out right now but it's not like how i really want it because i can't wear what i really want to wear right now not as far as like because i just want to be who don't want to be sexy but the type of shirts like some shirts are thin or some shirt might come a little down right here a little bit or it, it just depends on how the tops are made that I have in my closet even though I have t-shirts 
uh, some of the t-shirts you kind of can still t like certain shirts you just know like okay they have a sports bra on compared to a regular bra you know what I'm saying but so all my shirts are not that I have right now are not made to wear with the surgical bra so which I'm not tripping oh and guess what today y'all I made a mug today I made a one mug post up <laughs> I want my post up so yeah today has made one month and how i'm feeling i'm feeling real good as you can tell y'all know i'm still wearing the little things up under with this bra but i feel wonderful i feel wonderful um my sensation have came back so i feel any and every little thing that hits towards these nipples and girl if i take you care of that Cause they so sensitive. They're sensitive than the first time. So, whoo, Jesus, they are so sensitive. Um, but I feel good. I looked at all my scarring because my doctor did video call me this past this week, and he told me to take the tape off everything so we can look at it. And when he told me how to clean them, I mean clean the scars and stuff. Same way how I take a shower with the antibi uh, antibacterial soap. Did all that. I had to tape it right back up. And the scar looks real, real good. You could, some of the parts is already faded into, like the skin has faded in real good. You don't see where he has cut it at. Some of the areas you do see the cuts because the stitches, how the stitching was, like they have the invisible, sti uh, dissolvable stitches. So all of them really full haven't came out all the way. Some have, but some haven't not. Then I got the little, you know, the little extra, not extra skin, but the, 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 the scar skin that's coming off so maybe as far as that it still look good the scarring that goes down right here looks amazing and up under so i got a few little pieces that's kind of still healing up under not a whole lot that's why i was saying when i go to the doctor tuesday i'm going to see if i can get um something to start helping with the itching because how it's healing and start getting the silicone strips so i won't keep it because i kind of can tell little pieces right there how it's starting to look so hopefully when i go tuesday we'll see everything and know everything what's what but as far as that everything is healing well i'm feeling wonderful i'm getting my energy back how i need to be um hopefully i can start back working out when i go and he give me the approval start back with my waist trainer because like I said, I know when I have gained weight, I've been just laying in this house. I ain't been doing nothing, just laying around, eating, healing. And I, when I gain, you see it in my face, in my neck. So my neck all up under here has been sweating super, super dumb. And I've been real hot. Um, I feel it all in my arms. And I definitely feel it in my legs most of the time. But stomach uh, is still um, bloated situation. I'm bloated as well. It's because of... <sighs> I need to lose some of this again. And it's not bad, just I'm, I'm, I know what it's with. Like I said, I lose some of it, do my walks again, and then also me still going to the restroom right now because I'm still trying to get it all the way fully back to how I used to be, just regular. And then on top of that, this is the time of the month almost. So I got a lot going on in this little part of the area, which I'm not tripping. But all up in here, this got to get smell. Not slim, but this got to go down some because I feel it every time when I'm about to start doing anything. Like, I instantly start. It's like, this is up here. I start sweating right there and there. So, I know that's where my fat is at. All up under here and up in here. So, yeah. Other than that, I feel amazing. Uh, this is the best decision I ever made. I don't regret it. I feel lighter as far as on my shoulder and my back. I don't have a lot of weight on me as much like I used to. I'm easily to sleep now. I'm easy to get up, move around. Like I can literally just sit up without being slunched over. I feel amazing, y'all. I feel freaking amazing. Like I said, the best decision that I ever made. I wish I would have made this decision a long time ago, but um it just had to come to this point you know everything works out for a reason god do things for a reason so i'm just glad i got it done now and yeah that's my last surgery y'all it is my last surgery unless something just pop off something happens or later down the line as i get older i might need a little lipo here and there other than that yeah yeah because <laughs> honey 
the healing process is a motherfucker. That's all I'm gonna say. The healing process takes you out, sis. You definitely have to be strong minded. And sometimes you go into that into that um depression little stage here and there, regret and seeing if it was worth this. Should I have done this? Why is it taking so long to heal? Yeah, all this extra you wanna do certain things you can't do because of the hit it's just all that goes through you. All that goes through you. So be mindful when you wanna have surgery. Be ready for the outcome of everything that you got to go through. But you will love your results at the end of the day. Love your results at the end of the day. So, um, um, I to put, like I said, I have to put a little top on and record, do my review on my phone and stuff. I don't know if that vlog will be out before this one or this will be out before that. I don't know. It depends how I feel. Depends how I do it. I don't know. Whichever one, y'all get in the vlog. Okay? Y'all get in the vlog. Y'all see your girl working while I'm working, working. It just, yeah. So, you know, I was just like, opening it up Saturday, letting y'all know what's going on. And I just wanted to show my face because, like I said, I feel so pretty. I wanted to look pretty as I'm just sitting around the house. And, yeah. I'll talk to y'all later.